Hey everybody, it's Glenn and Jane with American Couple and we are in Washington State today and we are heading up to Mount Rainier. The weather outside it's is, definitely colder is than a Florida. lot colder than <laughs> Florida. Hopefully it won't rain. First stop is the Twin Furs Trail. The size of the trees in this park are just amazing. This particular tree here is about 200 feet tall. The color is here is just incredible. It's so beautiful. Never been to a Western forest. You want to get on top of it, don't you? Jane has relatives that live in the Seattle area. One of them happens to operate a tour bus that goes to Mount Rainier. And seeing Bridget is still in the emergency room, we thought it'd be a great idea. I'm pushing, I don't want to fall. Okay, we're about halfway up to the top of the mountain. We're at Christine Hall. It is absolutely gorgeous here. It's a beautiful day right now. It's about 40, oh, 55 degrees, yeah. 55 degrees outside. Um, it's a waterfall that's like under the road. So it's actually really cool. Yeah, there's two different steps to it. You can see that here. And then behind us is a roadway that it goes under. And like James said, there's a walkway down there that shows how the rest of it goes down. This particular waterfall is fed from the snow from the top of Mount Rainier. So it's pretty much like this all year round. We got here just luckily last week. It was like a heat wave and a lot of the snow has melted. So, so it's full. So it's it's full on waterfall. Yeah, so it's really, really beautiful. You go wash your hair in that one. <laughs> I would put the collar. There you go. There are small waterfalls all over this area. You haven't even seen the most beautiful part yet. Come look at this. People are really hiking these. Instead of steps down to Christine Falls, it's a very steep paved incline. Look, I'm at videotaping you videotaping me. <laughs> Aww. That is absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. It was kind of unusual for Jane and I not to drive on one of our adventures. But our bus driver Brian had driven this tour many times before. He knew every ravine and valley, every twist and turn in the road as we made our way up the mountain. This is another falls and we don't remember the name of it. In American couple fashion, I, it's 45 degrees out, wet and muddy, and I'm still in, in flip-flops. <laughs> so this trail is really slippery and muddy wet. and wet. Okay, we're gonna go down to the spray part of the falls. So, Jane wants to experience getting a little wet and cold. Nevada Falls! Oh, that's cold! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, I did not expect it to be like misty and wet and rainy. That's amazing! <laughs> Okay, that's snow over there and on the ground even. 
Okay, I'm freezing. I am not standing here any longer. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. I'm from Florida. I'm used to that. <laughs> we'll play in snow? Snow. No. I promised Brian that I wouldn't bring my muddy shoes back on the bus. Oh. We're inside the Grand Hall at the Paradise Inn. This place was built in the early 1900s and it's kind of the premier um, hotel that's up on Mount Rainier. It's absolutely gorgeous, beautiful inside here. I can only imagine like skiing up here or something and come and spend it the night. Yes, this is Mount Rainier. Well, we made it to the trailhead here, and unfortunately the fog has rolled in, and it doesn't look like we're gonna get much of a view of the mountain today. We're still hopeful, but it doesn't look like it. So the flip-flop explorer is realizing that the sandals probably weren't a great choice for today in the snow, but... Yeah, yeah. Snow. yeah, I didn't realize there were going to be snow. No. And you might have worn different shoes. So I knew it was going to be colder today, but not <laughs> snow. I'm sure this wasn't the waterfall we were looking for, but I think this is probably as far as we're going to make it, though. <laughs> Wait, there's not snow all the way up there. They said no. Oh, they said no. Okay. Why is everybody asking the guy with flip-flops whether there's snow everywhere? Because they're like, if he can do it. Well, what do you know? There is a no All right, after driving for an hour and a half in the fog, all of a sudden the fog has lifted and the mountain is here. Goes one, two, three. Got it. I didn't figure out how he did his. Mine has too much stuff around it. So we have made it to Wapata, Wapiti. Wapiti Willies he called it. <laughs> yes. Yeah. We've made it to Wapiti Willies and what other American couple trip could we have where we don't do ice cream? Ice cream. So we're going to do some ice cream. <laughs> ice cream time. Oh, excuse me. It doesn't matter if my feet were freezing cold, ice cream is always a way to end a perfect day.